So if your puppy is biting you a lot, it's important that you get a lot of clicks and treats on there when your puppy is not biting you. So notice here, the owner is clicking and treating when the puppy is not biting him. And then um, the puppy is going to go back to trying it again. That's totally normal for some puppies. And we want to avoid trying to push them off like the owner was doing there. You're better off using a lure, get the food in your hand, and moving the puppy off or getting a toy in your hand and redirecting them to a toy. So notice he's got the food in the hand now. He's asking the dog to leave it or drop. And then once that's happening where he opens his mouth and lets go of the pants, then he's clicking and treating. And now he's clicking and treating multiple times in a row for not biting him. So a lot of fast clicks and treats for keeping that muzzle or those teeth off of you and rewarding that good behavior is going to really help. And again, try to not push back with your hands. The dog is going to perceive that as play. You know that puppy biting can be such a struggle. And that's why I am offering a live Zoom webinar specifically on puppy biting. So after watching this video, are you feeling that you want some more step-by-step -step help on knowing all the techniques that you can know to get your puppy to stop biting you? If the answer to that question is yes, then you definitely want to sign up for our live Zoom puppy webinar. Go to the link and sign up now. And you definitely want to do it as soon as you can because it's going to happen on October 13th and it's the only time I'm going to be offering it live. So you don't want to miss this once in a lifetime opportunity to help you create more peace of mind with your pup. See you there.